hey guys welcome back to my channel so guys as you all know here on my channel i share a lot of things about how to grow your hair healthy using natural ingredients on today's video i'll be showing you guys how you can make your own hair moisturizer this moisturizer is made purely from natural ingredients and also it will help you retain your length because if you want to grow longer hair you should pay attention to retaining your hair length and retaining your length simply means growing longer hair So guys, our first ingredient is this papaya leaf, popularly called purple leaf in Nigeria. You guys can see that it's freshly plucked. The content found in this papaya leaf is very beneficial for healthy hair growth. It helps to promote hair growth, prevent balding and thinning of hair. This leaf contains several compounds with an antioxidant properties such as vitamin E, flavonoid and other important properties. This, this leaf also help in prevention of scalp diseases like scalp inches, dandruff, scalp irritation which will cause your hair growth to delay. So the first thing you want to do is clean up this leaf because it's freshly plugged and you go ahead and blend it. Blending this leaf is not the easiest so you might want to take your time and blend it. You can just add in very little water just so you can fasten uh, the process. So guys, this is what it's going to look like after blending it. Like I said, blending it is not that easy. So you take your time and blend it into a pastry form and this is what it's going to be looking like. So just go ahead and keep this aside and we'll move to the next step. So here you need your coconut oil. And for the coconut oil, you are going to be needing about 5 tablespoons. You can add as much as you want, depending on how much you want this uh, moisturizer to come out. So you just add about 5 tablespoons. Up next is our mango butter. You can use any butter of your choice, whether cocoa butter, whether shea butter. But for this video, I'm going to be using this mango butter. You also go ahead and add in about five tablespoon to you can actually use any measurement of your choice depending on how much or how small you want to make so i add in about five tablespoon of my mango butter then i go on and add in my shea butter so like i said earlier you can use any butter of your choice so at this point i also go ahead and add in my black rice oil which i have shared in this video you can add in any oil of your choice i also add in my uh, olive oil you can add in your coconut oil almond oil any oil of your choice and i'll go ahead and melt it hair butters are generally good for the hair they help to trap in moisture into the hair also help to moisturize the scalp against any form of dryness and also they protect the hair against the sun so after melting your oil you go ahead and add in your blended papaya leaf so with this process you have to be very patient you guys can see that i'm using the double boiling method which means i am not boiling this directly on the heat doing the double boiling method is going to help everything all the goodness from this leaf infuse well into the butter but if you boil directly on the heat some of the ingredients might over boil and it will not be that potent the way it's supposed to so all I did was just put in some water into my boiler and place my mixture on top and let it heat up for some minutes. So this process is going to take you some time, you just have to be patient. So after about 15 minutes, this is what it looks like. Oil will just turn to green as you guys can see. Everything is boiling up and you just give it time to boil. At this point, the mixture has actually get very heated and this is what it's going to be looking like. So after leaving it to boil for some minutes more, I will go ahead and strain out this mixture. So this is what it looks like. You can use any clothes of your choice, uh, clothes that you make sure it will not leave you with any form of residue that is going to give you a very smooth consistency. So this is what it looks like. It's going to give you this greenish look and it doesn't really smell bad. It doesn't have like a particular smell that's what i can say so this is what it looks like i'll go ahead and put it in my fridge and let it sit there for like 30 minutes so that it can solidify so this is what it looks like obviously so because of the shea butter mango butter you should expect something like this 
so guys at this stage you can go ahead and add in your preservative if you want but for me i store mine in my fridge so i'll go ahead and add in my essential oil about five drops of my duty oil my glycerin my lavender oil rosy oil you can go ahead and add in as much essential oil as you want and this essential oil are very beneficial for your scalp they help to stimulate hair growth and also keep your scalp free from any form of diseases so i'll just go ahead and use my anmisa and mix everything together and a good part of this thing is the fact that after mixing it it doesn't really go back to solid you guys know what happens when you whip butter it doesn't really go back to solid solid it's going to be giving you that ice cream kind of consistency if you don't take it back to the fridge it will not solidify but if you just keep it in a very cool environment it will just remain like this to give you this moisturizing texture for easy application i just go ahead and transfer it to my applicator bottle and i will show you guys how i apply this to my hair and again i want to mention you don't have to worry because this does not really stain your hair that loose green does not mean it stain your hair no it doesn't stain your hair it just absorb into your into your hair as oil and butter it doesn't leave your hair greenish so guys this is what my hair look like dry out of protective style and i'm going ahead and adding this moisturizer i didn't bother adding any product to my hair because i know that i'm going to be adding this moisturizer to my hair and believe me guys it feels so good like my hair feels so soft if you're the type that your hair always dry out fast you need this moisturizer and as you can see this is made with purely natural ingredient my hair look a lot stretched out because i usually do like a twist overnight and twist is one of the best way you can stretch out your hair without heat so guys i just applied it to my hair strand it made my hair feel really fluffy and soft and again and again you can apply it to your scalp because it also prevents scalp diseases so if you're the type that is suffering from any form of hair dryness or hair breakage this is something you should consider in fact moisturizer conditioner should be your best friend because this will prevent your hair from drying out and let me tell you guys something about hair dryness if your hair is always dry that means it will be open to breakage and shedding and when you're experiencing excessive shedding or breakage your hair will remain the same length and you feel like your hair is not going so the best thing you can do for your hair is to retain your hair by making sure you're not experiencing excessive shedding or breakage so guys this is what my hair look like and also apply this to my edges as you guys can see it's not looking greenish like i said that the color is green does not mean it will stain your hair to be greenish so it absorbs into your hair as oil and butter and believe me this will go a long way keeping your hair healthy because it's made with natural ingredient so here on my channel i share everything about growing your hair healthy looking after your hair effortlessly and if this sounds like something you like to watch please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys